of shooting in Sportsman Acres just outside of Pryor Creek. An officer killed a man after a brief shootout. Two Works For You reporter Kessler McLaughlin is live in Mays County with more on what happened. Kessler. Brian, we're live in Sportsman Acres in the neighborhood where that makes up most of the town. Now, neighbors who witnessed the shooting between a man and police are a bit shaken up. Just steps away from a playground in Sportsman's Acres. We saw the guy come out of his house with the rifle. The unthinkable for a small town. And they had their little shootout and saw him, the guy, go down. April DeSpinnett saw it all go down from two houses away. And I got on the phone and called 911 in case he didn't have time to get nobody to come help him. Her concern. They weren't home from school yet, thank God. The impending arrival of children. I was petrified about the school bus coming and seeing it all. She had never seen anything like it. It was scary, but different. I was like, I got, I was hoping they were both going to be okay. The officer told him to put the gun down. And he didn't do it. Clifton Wolf saw it from across the street. They ended up sticking that gun up to his face. I was going to pull the trigger, then that cop told him to put it down. And then the dude that came out pointed that gun at the cop, and that cop just shot him. He feared for his life. I thought he was going to end up pointing the gun towards us and start shooting. And got my prayers in for the family. Now, we understand that man had barricaded himself in the home that you can see here behind us just before police arrived, and he was suicidal. Now, thankfully, no one else was involved in the incident tonight. Live in Mays County, Kessler McLaughlin, Two Works For You.